I have gifts. You guys sent me gifts. I'm so <laughs> excited. Okay, I'm gonna open these gifts and I am going to send you every ounce of love that I have while I do it. First one. I hope it tells you who it's from. Surely it'll tell you who it's from, right? I've never done this before, obviously. Okay, there's papers, so that probably means there's something. Sonia, good buddy. Oh my gosh, I needed this so bad. I This is um, a mobile power bank. <laughs> It's a power brick. I don't have one and I don't have nearly enough like power storage options. I'm always running out of power. Like my phone is the biggest thing that I just need to keep, you know, charged so that I can stay in touch with my daughter and you know, safety reasons and all of that. So this is gonna help with that. Thank you so much, Sonia. I appreciate it so much. Travel well, Birdie. And you know I will travel better now. Thank you so much. Next. Linda. Good buddy. I'm about to be safe as a mofo. Yup, uh-huh, stun gun. Stunning. I have to charge it. Pretty sure. Oh, no, I don't. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I will charge it, but obviously, apparently, it comes a little bit charged already. So, you know, um, hands clear from the silver thing. But if you're a baddie, get back. I have the power of Linda. <laughs> this really does make me feel so much safer. Thank you so, so much. All I had was some pepper spray, and I'm not even 100% sure how to spray it. I know I don't, I'm not very, I'm not a prepared person. But guess what? Even if I don't, I'm just gonna have this one here so I can just, uh, uh, gotcha, gotcha, Linda gotcha, Linda gotcha. <laughs> Thank you so much, Linda. You are so cool. I'm gonna put it right here by my bed. Linda said, stay safe, be happy, positive thoughts. I wish you all the best. Your thoughts and fears are very similar to mine. We are not alone. We are not alone. You guys are making me really understand how important it is to know that we are not the only people that are struggling with whatever it is we're struggling with at the time. And so I can't thank you enough for that. Just the message alone. Thank you so much, Linda. Next. I can't find the name for this one, but it's chocolate. Sweet tooth rejoice. This is going to hit the spot and it's going to last me forever. So that's just amazing. Special dark. I'm a dark chocolate fan. Oh, this is going to be so good. I'm going to share some with my daughter too. I hope that's okay. Cause she's a huge milk chocolate fan and she's going to be very excited. So, oh gosh, I wish I knew who sent it. I'm so sorry. I can't acknowledge you specifically, but whoever sent it, this is so sweet. And my sweet tooth is very appreciative of you. Thank you so, so much. Next. Ooh, yes. Carbon monoxide alarm. Those are so important to have. And I haven't had one. I know I just have not been. I have not been a very professional van lifer, but you guys are getting me there. Look at this. I am going to know if that carbon monoxide is trying to suffocate me. Don't you do that carbon monoxide. I wish you safety and security, Birdie. Love from Joanne. Good buddy. Thank you so much, Joanne. Appreciate it so much. And I ain't going to get hurt by no stinking carbon monoxide. Who does carbon monoxide think they are anyway? Dang it. <laughs> Next. Perhaps the person didn't even know, or maybe Amazon failed and didn't put the note in there. So I'm sorry, I don't know who this is from. Maybe you wanted to be anonymous. So I'm gonna just, uh, I'm gonna assume that maybe that's what it is. And so, but it, it, who, whoever you were, if you wanna tell me who you were, I wanna tell you, I wanna know who you were and I wanna thank you personally. And this is, ooh, okay, this is, it's a towel. It's perfect. I have been using just a kitchen towel to dry myself off after I take a shower, you know, cause it's small. Sorry about this random hair hanging there. I get them all the time. It's like they're decoration somehow. I don't know. Anyway, I've just been using this tiny little kitchen towel to wash myself off, but it was like one of those regular like terry cloth ones. So it would take forever to dry and just pain the biot. So this is bigger, but you know, it's going to be fine. I, if I was doing great with just the with the thing and that was like half this size. So I, I can totally do it with this and it will dry. It's like specifically, you know, one of them dry quick things and it even comes with a little carrying case that has vents in it so that it can still go. <laughs> I feel so fancy. I'm sorry. I don't know the name of the person who sent this to me, but man, am I appreciative because I have needed this a whole, whole bunch. And, uh, you know, me and my clean self, thank you from the bottom of my clean heart. Next. It's kind of heavy. <gasps> wait, wait, what? It's like more than one thing. Sherry, 
You bought me so many things! Sherry! Hello, Birdie. I stumbled upon your YouTube channel and just wanted to send you a little love. I know that you flirted with religion, but it's pray in my prayer you discover Jesus. You know what? I love Jesus. I love Jesus. I don't know for sure whether or not he is actually God's, you know, given son, but I do believe that Jesus existed, and I do believe that he loved human beings beyond any other probably human being ever to live, and I think that his lessons were the best lessons that any human being has ever taught. And so I 100% model a lot of my character after what Jesus said. So I love Jesus. I cannot believe, like, what the heck? The life straw. So if I'm ever like stranded somewhere and I need to drink water out of a puddle or something, you know, that happens. It freaking happens. And so now I have this, so I will not dehydrate if I ever get stuck somewhere. Like I will, this is, this peace of mind, just this alone. Sherry, thank you so much. Fairy lights. Can you even be a van lifer without fairy lights? I don't think that my official van lifeness has even started until now because I now have fairy lights. It's gonna look so cool. I'm gonna look so cool. I can't wait to show you what they look like hung up. And you're really just trying to make me so safe over here. This is the shovel. You know, it's like a shovel that you can use, which, you know, I may need to get out of where I'm at right now because it's very muddy. I might need to dig myself out, you know? Ooh, look at the pack. How fancy schmancy is that? They're like, you going to get stuck? Oh, no, you're not. It's got like the pick. It's got like the saw edge. It's just going to be fantastic. I don't know how to <laughs> figure that out. But um, this is so much peace of mind. Particularly, I'm thinking it'll be good for if I ever need to dig myself out of it. Like when I was stuck, when my butt was stuck. <laughs> was stuck on the side of that mountain this would have come in super handy thank you so much oh my gosh you're really really over here gonna keep me safe from all the ills of the world uh, and a vacuum you guys i put this on there this is such a luxury item i've just been sweeping it out and it's very hard to get all the you know just to keep clean you know what i mean and there's like dust everywhere when you live basically on the side of roads a lot of the time you know especially if you're out camping you get dust like everywhere and it's so hard to maintain so i wanted i wanted this really bad but i hesitated to put it on the list because it's just a luxury it's definitely not a necessity you know what i mean sherry i can't i can't believe you got this for me i i'm struggling with the idea that i deserve any of this but i am so freaking grateful because I'm going to be clean and I'm going to be safe and you and I'm going to be an official van lifer. Thank you so much, Sherry. Okay, last one. It's so big. I don't remember even putting anything on there that big. <gasps> Wait, yes I do. Oh my gosh. <laughs> two things. Two things. Y'all are spoiling me so hardcore. Your channel brings me so much joy and laughter every week. Thank you. Thank you for sharing your life with us. This is so fantastic. Are you kidding me? So can you see? I don't know if I need to like block my face or whatever. It's just this tiny little strainer. I have a strainer from the dollar store. It's very big. It takes up so much space. Boy, howdy, do you really need to maximize your space savings when you live in a vehicle? So this, look at this, it's tiny and you can just fold it up and it's even tinier. And then you hook it to the side of the pot and you can just like tip the pot over and it will strain it out. And it's just this little small little thing. How cool is that? It's very cool. That's how cool it is. And then this is another luxury item. I just have pots and pans from the Goodwill and they're big, you know what I mean? Like here, you can eat, like, this is not even a big pot, but it still takes up a lot of room because the stinking, you know, the, the, whatever this word is, <laughs> the handle. So the handles of the pots take up so much room that it makes it hard to, you know, to store them. So these ones, <laughs> yes, these ones have a detachable handle. One handle for all of them, which makes it so much easier in my mind. So here's a pot, here's a pot, and then a frying pan, because who doesn't need a frying pan? And again, the best part, although, I mean, just this part is good, because I am like, this is, 
this is uh, quality, you know? The ones that I have are super, super thin. You know, I just got them for like three and four dollars or whatever from the Goodwill, and they're super, super thin. So it's like hard to get, you know, I'm not the best cook anyway, <laughs> so I need a little help. And I think that the thicker bottom is going to help me get more even cooking. I'm gonna be Gordon Ramsay before you know it. And uh, non-stick which is fantastic, but you know, um, if you're using nonstick, make sure that you do not heat it without anything in there, that you don't overheat it so that it doesn't release those PFAS, PFOS, I'm not sure. It's a chemical that's super duper bad. So if you didn't know that, you know that now. And if you have birds, never use nonstick around them. It's very, very bad for them. Anyway, I just feel like it's important to talk about that when we talk about Teflon, but it is amazing. It makes it so much easier for cooking and cleaning. And these feel so like, I just can't believe how thick the bottoms feel, so superior. And then I guess, let's see, how do you do this? You just, oh, oh, okay, so you press it and that like opens it and then you can put it here. And now you have a handle. Insta handle, so great because right now my pots and pans and the colander, if you add it all together, takes up like this much, like probably this much floor space. Now it's gonna take this much floor space. Mind blown, so freaking grateful. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Holly. I can't even tell you how surprised I was. I was with my daughter when I looked and I saw that everything had been bought off the wish list. And we both were just like, what the what? <laughs> I don't know how. I don't know how I deserve any of this. I don't know how you guys found me or I found you or we found each other. I don't know how any of that stuff works. All I know is that I am just so shocked and so grateful and so excited to know you and that people would actually want to do anything like this for me. It's not a familiar feeling, but it is an amazing feeling. And I cannot thank you enough. And I do know that the wish list is, is empty right now. I'm thinking of things that I can add that are reasonably priced that I can actually fit into the van. Because, you know, the only things that I can really think of, uh, think of off the top of my head that I need right now are things that are just too dang old expensive to put on the list. Like I need like a good camera, a better power station, I, maybe a roof box. I can't decide if I want a roof box or solar panels up there, but all of that is too expensive to add to the wish list. So I'm trying to figure out if I can like add cards or, you know, something to make it as easy as possible for you guys, but that isn't me asking for too dang much. You know what I mean? I will figure that out. But in the meantime, I am just absolutely bowled over by your love and your generosity and your kindness. And I cannot thank you enough. And I am so excited to start cooking without worrying about carbon monoxide poisoning and to tell the meanie heads to back the heck off and to eat some chocolate and to not dehydrate and to light up my world, clean it, to shovel it. Oh, I'm gonna do all the things. And we're gonna have power to do it while we're doing it. Power to do it while we're doing it. You know what I mean? I missed one. Oh my gosh. Okay, wait, we have to get this one. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Decent light. I can see what's happening at night. I just wrote the best song ever. I saw something like this on Minivan Lee's channel and I have um you know really no light <laughs> at night. <clears throat> I mean I have this little like battery powered thing and this like candle candle thing. They're both well they're both battery powered from the dollar store. And so they do you know, a decent enough job, but I definitely couldn't like do anything crafty at night or write at night or like, you know, anything that requires a decent amount of light. I have kind of a bad eyesight anyway, so it gets dark and it's hard, it's hard for me to see. So these are supposed to put off a good amount of light. They're rechargeable. They last for a long time. Also think that it'd be good for filming because there's lots of times where it's late at night and I wanna film something. I have something to say, but it's too dark and you won't be able to see my face. So I just blow it off and then I forget what it is and then I'm, you know, a bad YouTuber. <laughs> this is gonna help me be a better YouTuber. Heck yeah, buddy. <laughs> gonna be amazing. Thank you so much for lighting up my world. Oh wait, where's the name of the person? Sonia, good buddy. You gave me something else too. Oh my gosh, Birdie, I love your channel. You are a warrior. Mm. I'm a warrior. Oh, thank you so much. 
Listen, I am a warrior who now has a light, a lit up life. Thanks to you, Sonia. And between you and Sherry, I am going to be lit up like a movie star. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You're so generous. Thank you so much, good buddies. I appreciate you so much. And I will be back, uh, you know, soon with a vlog because I'm out here in the boonies and it's amazing. Have a fantastic day, week, month, year, life. <laughs> I love you. Bye. Post editing script, post, uh, post script. Maybe this is a post script. I wanted to let you know that I do have a notification that I have more stuff at the post office or the mailbox to go pick it up. And I'm just curious if you guys want me to, do you even want me to film these? You know, I want this channel to be as a democracy, as I have said before. So do you guys want me to continue filming when I open these? Is that something y'all want to see? Is it something you would want me to like maybe do as an unlisted video instead of a listed video? Or should I just not do it? What would you prefer? because I'm gonna just go with what majority rules says. I have to admit like there's a little bit of me that feels a little bit like self-conscious about making a video like this. Almost like it's bragging a little bit but I don't know if that's just my own like brain telling me that you know. That's why I was coming to y'all. Do you want me to film these things in the future you know when I open these gifts or would you rather me just keep it to myself and just send a little private note to the person. So anyway let me know what you think about that and I will go with whatever majority rules says. Okay thank you. Bye.